Okay, I think uh, let me start with the technical presentation, then I will uh, talk about the entrepreneurship. That should be the two topics today, okay? Okay, sir. Yes, okay. Sir, you can start. <clears throat> okay, until the until the presentation comes, maybe I'll I'll give a small intro about me. Uh, so this is Selvraj. I am from uh, actually I'm not that far from you all. Okay, I am very close to you guys because uh, I am from Yero district only. And um, I and uh, uh, before I start, I just wanted to thank my parents. I just want to thank my all college professors, lecturers, and my gurus, my God. And if this presentation can help you with uh, some more technical ideas and also entrepreneurship, I'll be grateful. And uh, with that uh, note. um let me start and also take this as a grocery approach grocery sh uh, shop when you go to grocery shop and where uh, you know you, you pick whatever you want okay so uh, and my my ride is was a roller coaster ride actually uh, because uh, i started my career and i this as we get along with the next one i will i will uh, you will see me how my life has been a roller coaster ride but let me go through this presentation first and then uh, we can talk about uh, more details about um, you know and to know about me and uh, what we do okay so this is one of the presentation uh, one of the project that uh, uh, let me run in a presentation mode slide so okay uh, i hope uh, i hope you are able to see it can somebody acknowledge once again yes sir it is yes. on the presentable mode sir okay excellent excellent again i'm sorry um, for the technical difficulties okay this project is all about uh, one of the aerospace industry here and uh, we are trying to implement how we can uh, reduce uh, downtime how we can uh, save some more uh, time uh, during the process you know during the uh, parts develop how we develop parts and uh, how we can help uh, by implementing some more process uh, along the way okay and uh, and in introducing some uh, testing methods and all what do you see in this picture is some of the pictures from the company okay what is this project what is the problem statement this problem statement is this is a microstructure failure on top of coating you know you have uh, the coating all the parts it comes with the coating if you see here this these are all minor coating and i will as we go along i will explain i will explain you how this coating can be a crack and how this crack can be voided and un, in un, in unmelted uh, materials and how this results in machine downtime you know so we will go through that why this project every every minute it is a 10 dollar saving for the management every day it is a 20000 uh, dollar saving otherwise in, a, in other word yeah penny saved is penny earned right so here if you see here this much this much is amount that you can uh, save for the company you always need to look at how much you can save for the company how you can be how much you can be more productive this project requires almost 200 thousand dollar plus additional 200 thousand dollars as a capital asset as a project cost and this will span across almost three years the goal is to implement the process why why we want to implement the process the either is a good uh, whether but the coding inspection and then control system okay so uh, i i am sure you all might have heard uh, audience i think various from colleges you have some professors i heard some of the students um i would really insist uh, if you have already gone through six sigma model it will be great if not this is a small intro for you anything that you do that comes from define measure analyze improve control and results it's called you know demise so uh, this is how we handle this project so we have to define the project and you should be able to measure it and you should be able to analyze and improve then have a some control mechanism and then in results okay so in this process cypark what is cypark it's a very important customer is god right everybody knows 
customer is god we are all studying we are all learning we are all doing r and d research everything for the benefit of the customer at end customer you need to satisfy okay whatever may be the hurdles whatever may be the struggles today like we have gone through the struggle it's okay now we are on a good ride let's enjoy the ride be with me just another 30 40 minutes just be with me i don't mind extending another 5 10 minutes but be with me and understand the technicality behind and the entrepreneur's mindset behind why we do all this the why is the customer the cyborg model is it it talks about the process you know what are the process in the cyborg you you are you are supplier you are inputs you are process outputs and customer so if you if you see here just one example if you take dry sample step then who is my supplier lab district testing team is my supplier then you need to be a team player you need to work with that team and what are the inputs and then process and then output then what who is the end customer that is this is a process flow map that we how we map it you know it's 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 very important to understand our input and output it is very important for us to understand the process flow when you define a process you should you need to know where is the destination who is your end customer you know and this process map defines it okay this failure mode analysis very important to understand potential failures so if we see, if you see here like a lack of uh, lack of uh, impregnation pull off way and edge retention this kind of uh, uh, process more that we we are able to identify and what is the severity and the number of occurrences all those things you can identify there are two uh, uh, type of uh, pf uh, mea uh, there is a design level and product level the i mean what we are talking about the product level and the gauge plus rr so this is about your uh, uh, this is one of the study how you can verify how you can evaluate this is the different methods and available maybe i'll i'll deep i will dive into one of the method uh, so that you will have a better understanding so this is <clears throat> this is some of the charts from uh, variation from the component some of the how how it is varied by operators how this is varied by different different charts and different part and different you know we captured as an uh, data collection that you will see uh, as a net data collection so what we what we have done we have collected all this uh, i am sure you all know liquor scale there are there are scale rating liquor scale rating there is a book on that you can study about it and uh, so like here 1 to 10 we we measure and the, each each testing outcome we will uh, they it will receive a liquor scaling you know 10 being the outstanding if you see here cracks voids uh, this minute particle you see here arrow marks i hope you are able to see all this cracks that we need to identify here if you see there some of the voids so where the material when it is melts but it is not completely where, where you have uh, voids and that is why it, there are some unmelts all this will lead to uh, issue as a as a deduction okay Uh, in the, in our project because of this covid situation we got the number of resources down so we had to simulate some of the numbers like uh, uh, in the humidity and uh, i hope you all understand even in between two metals when you put water there is a humidity and if you if you uh, apart bring it apart there is a different humidity there is a humidity meter that you can you can uh, uh, measure the humidity of the room and measure the humidity of the of that the situation in the part the part okay so because of the covid situation we have to little bit uh, reschedule our projects but however this is a fantastic uh, sky square test i don't know how many of you have used it uh, at least learn if you are not it am i okay am i audible still good sir good sir good okay okay good so <clears throat> so if if we had to stop me debug just uh, shout because i i i am only seeing the presentation i don't see the participants now okay sure sir so what is sky square test so this is one of the very good test among uh, there are so many tests like your regression test sky square test what do we understand from the sky square test is a p value so what is the likelihood of it is like for example let me give you easy example for, for you so when you when you roll in uh, say a uh, coin when you have a head and head and then uh, you have uh, you know tail head and tail you have like uh, uh, 
two, when the probability of when you do like a fifty times flip the coins, how many times probability? How many times that you are going to get the head? How many times you are going to get the uh, get the tail like that? So like that in the during the test we collected about two hundred two hundred samples that you see here. So what we we can use what is chi square? Simple formula for you is. Uh, it is the uh, observed result minus expected, you know, expected value divided by you see uh, expected value whole squared is nothing but your sky squared result in formula. I'm sure some of you may know it, six sigma if you. And then what is the p value? Is it, there is a standard p value in this uh, test? Like if you if you take a die again, uh, you have a six. Six dice, and then if you have, if you roll in six dice, that means you have a six probability, and that six variations. In that, how many times you are going to get one? How many times two? How many times six? Like that, you can uh, you uh, you know you can calculate the numbers and achieve a p value. So the p value here in the first uh, left side Likert scale for the person it comes to about point zero point zero three eight, which is within accepted value. You know there is also uh, um, you know parameter how you define what is accepted value. It is nothing but uh, if it is a below 0.5, then it is accepted value in a null hypothesis. And the same way, if you look at in the Likert and the saw, there is a and you get here 0.795, which is not significant factor as well. So that is how you get the result. And um, let me move on to this is one of the another uh, regression analysis. Some of you may be wondering, oh, what are these tools and the available um, a team? Uh, guys, please aware, most of the time when you leverage tools, your work becomes easy. So that's why we need to learn a lot of uh, tools and, um, uh, and available uh, systems to easy our uh, job. So this is one of the tool for the graphical analysis, which is a regression test. And uh, if it is nothing but a Likert scale value, and then you got, you work with the humidity, and uh, you take the analysis variance, and apply here. And when I am getting here R squared fit values 84.7 percentage, which is which is the suggests is a secondary effect of uh, you know high success rate. And um, uh, this is a continuation of the graphical chart, and um, this is a process <coughs> mapped how KPI and how mapped to KPO. And uh, for various occurrences and deductions, I don't want to get into deep. And uh, here you have like a uh, coat uh, samples and how the cut, how the dry, when you mount, what happens, when you grind, all kinds of things. And uh, each each KPI is identified uh, by the operator. And then you have a hypothesis, different different hypotheses of potential failures. Uh, that we while clamping force or while drying the method or queue time. So we go through all kinds of uh, um, uh, variations that we take into sources, different sources basically. You know, even temperature low, and that is a variance for us. Even uh, speed, disk speed, get speed, cool and flow, all those, you know. All right. <clears throat> then this is some of the uh, DOE plan and then the high score and uh, uh, clamping force, all those. And uh, go forward. What is our and it comes with the data. So I don't worry about this technical aspect of it. And um, I, I also wanted to emphasize any project when you go to when you go to uh, the define a measure and you know uh, analyze and uh, improvement the control then uh, you know results. So in this, uh, if you see, you need to know what is your going forward plan. You need to have that milestone of every project that you handle. Okay, that's what we defined as a, this is what our uh, uh, project plan. And uh, this one, we are still under, uh, you know, construction now. So once we have the control phase, once we reach control phase, this is what <clears throat> what we control, how the statistical analysis, what, how is the process control, where is the fault tree, where is the root cause, and then control method and who controls, and you have that ownership and have the SOP to direct on that. So that's uh, very specific. It is very, very specific. And we go through all random study, normal study, different different kinds of studies and fill in these numbers. And this is how we establish process capability as a post implementation. We don't just leave that. So this this all come, come from a long, long term six sigma and uh, <clears throat> okay. So 
uh, thanks for listening and i would suggest this is very this your take away from this should be of of this this, this is your take away very very important take away of this session and then uh, how we go through any process when we do this our our goal is to save for the company um uh, it's 20000 dollars per day all right so now i am going to open another uh, chart and uh, another uh, quick presentation for you uh, let me see if i am able to bring this up and uh, what time is it do are we good with time it is 8 2 maybe i should be done in another 15 minutes is that okay yes sir here it is 5:32 only sir okay okay good so any questions so far any questions maybe i can take one or two questions then i move on to um i'm going to give my life life learn lessons maybe that will also help you some of you uh <clears throat> Uh, before i proceed any questions <clears throat> okay i'm going to bring up uh, another slide here i guess i guess no questions uh, because it is silent so i do i don't see so your I, Silva sir, I have one question, sir. Go ahead, sir. Uh, are you doing that same thing for your company, or all over that you are giving an idea about saving the money to your company? Yeah, this is <clears throat> this is my colleague. As you saw the presentation, um, this is for the company, but that is not for my company. I am doing it for another company as a project, along with uh, two other colleagues, two other colleagues from that company. Okay, that means that twenty dollar per day will bring you a company for a profitable manner. Yeah. Is, is it, sir? Yes, that's correct. Okay. Thank you, sir. So, yes, yes. See, always you have to see. Maybe uh, before I start, uh, uh, do you see the debug, sir? Do you see my presentation yet? Yes, sir. Able to see, sir. Okay, this I would consider as a men and woman. Okay, for uh, for this team, I see a lot of men here in the call logged in. Um, so I can I can see you know I can can uh, talk about men and women here call. Is that okay? Yeah, full screen, sir. Full screen. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to full screen. Uh, okay. All right. Let me go to full screen now. <clears throat> Okay, so this is I'm going to press that. I request all the participants to mute your audio and video. Okay, so by the way, uh, Selvraj Nagamuthu is my LinkedIn profile. Selvraj Nagamuthu also my Facebook uh, profile. If anybody wants connect with me, feel free. Okay, so the whole world is there for you, and. Uh, um and uh, and how about uh, people in the call all from tamil nadu right so various states also yes, there sir oh i see because i, I wanted to start the session with uh, saying that uh, you know katrade uh, you know kai alavu kalladathu ulagalavu apdi ningar mari okay what is in uh, that is in uh, tamil in um, you know put it in english <laughs> what do you say what do you learn this you know only your uh, palm palm size that is what we learned whether you have done phd or you have done double phd or you have done masters or you have done i have done i have done my this is my third master degree i am doing you know uh, because i had a vision men without a vision shall perish why we say that because in um, i am i am not sure how many people are here in the christian and um, in i really like this in bible study bible men without vision shall perish every man should have a vision and if you are married every man should have a visionary woman with you so so your life will be beautiful okay so uh, this is very important to have for any any entrepreneur okay and when you have a mission do you have a mission 
statement for your life i do have it what is your mission and what is your vision what is your values behind that very important to understand this mission and vision values for your life my parents are my best entrepreneurs my amma she taught me how to sell wooden stakes in the market for 1 rupee 2 rupee that's how my entrepreneurship mindset came from how many of you are adding value to your parents on daily life in daily basis that's so important and then comes to my wife selvi who is not only bringing up two beautiful daughters but also being an entrepreneur helping me all around the world this is my 15th country i am living because of her because she instilled that dream in me you know these are my two daughters and you can look for three sisters as youtube channel and they run this youtube channel and they also teach in uh, here they have couple of students they are entrepreneurs they not the, the flag that you see it is a united nations where they went and they did the inauguration uh, performance and they they meet various entrepreneurs various people from various countries so that is why in tamil we say thirai kadal odiyum thiraviyam thedu why we say that you don't be a, like a kenathu thavali don't be a frog in getting into one jar and live a life go around the spread the wing go around the places but don't forget where you come from because my daughters they learned this lean concept from their grandparents in the farming you know the lean concept it starts from your home the lean concept starts from your home don't forget that don't discount that don't take it for granted and the basic math it start in schools don't underestimate finance if you are not with good with finance whatever may be you are good in whatever the education does not help you as an entrepreneur if you want to lead a life in a good way are you good in your finance are you accountable important are you person ready to kill your bad habits a lot of people will say i have this that that are you ready to clean up are you ready to delete some files from your memory not only your computer delete the bad things do you have a guts to delete it that's why it is very important to delete those things do you have a mindset of leadership the leadership is not start with the, in any developed country it is very important to have a teamwork where you can learn teamwork very important even you can learn in the villages and you can learn every step of your life learn to work with 80% mentality of the people and the challenges come and go because of lot of people have challenges working with the husband and wife for example even this husband goes on side wife goes on side lecturer goes another side and student goes this side and man you are all missing the resources don't fight simple with the ego forget the ego come to the reading part you know leading all the leaders are readers but not all the readers are not leaders my family is reading family every one of us are we are all readers these are my family my daughters my wife and they are good in dance they are good in uh, sports they are good in uh, you know da- and not only that you share whatever you learn you share my daughters they they are, they are giving the interview in the new york uh, tv here but we come from one small village back in perundurai so spread your wing and have a like abdul kalam said have a big dream dream big don't be scared understand purpose of your life what is your purpose in that life definite a purpose definite purpose of your life that is so important to understand i that is what i learned from my parents the happiness the giving the caring the those things that's why you need to care for people it's not about a sales speech it's about caring speech when you want to be an entrepreneur when you want to successful in your life you need to lead you need to lead people you are not a stand alone island you know you need to have a fun you need to have a teaming work on confidence courage to go and tell people and whatever you learned if you learn something good in the session tell people because i believe luck is not a god given thing luck is there all about how much you are prepared to face the opportunity 
opportunity will come and go even covid virus has come it is an opportunity for me i am very productive these days very very productive i am working 16 hours that is an opportunity for me that's why i define this as a luck you know skills take knowledge take hard work if you add, add all these alphabets what it comes to 100% in your life you know you know this uh, picture here attitude it's not about hard work it's not about how much knowledge you have it's all about attitude how you carry yourself how you are submissive to your professor how you are submissive how you are fighting the fight they look at this velu nachiar who was in 1700s who was fighting british won the british 10 years he ruled that was the story that we come from that much courage people don't forget your history go beyond the history understand some people's victory and celebrate victory and not just the victory understand the make awareness make awareness someone who is available understand the big data understand the understand the petrol news me understand the technology understand whatever you have whatever you okay somebody can be on mute arish arish usman khan okay this usman is khan. important usman khan okay okay no problem i'll give a minute Pause. yes sir mute okay good so why this slide everybody everyone yes. need to understand kya ho cover hai kai upar le le sir so nahi le le Yeah. Can I continue? Usman Khan, you. Now you can continue, sir. So I muted, sir. You can continue. Okay. What is masawa? Okay. If not anything else, you need to understand this very important. This is how you make sure someone is available with some information. That's all about technology. That's all about uh, big data. That's all about. Uh, cloud that's all about analysis tools networking every one of you should be doing very good networking because the whole world is connected now it is not about us, uh, no more silo no more you are restricted to one college or one location or your competitors are around the world understand your competitors it is around the world and you can now you are you can spread the wing from see how we are connected even in this call um we are connected across the globe across the colleges and how are you leveraging this technology for your growth that is most important you grow your village grows your town grows your country grows when our country grows we all grow and how are you going to leverage this technology that is so important it's okay to make mistakes see at the end how many people are better off because of you live life that's how my parents told me selva how many people are really better off because of you lived in this planet earth everybody if you see here either zig ziglar or napoleon hill says a quitter never wins a winner never quits take up a challenge either your presentation see i was a very poor in english up to my 12th grade i was studying in a i was studying in a, uh, in a government school i studied only tamil but i don't mind now teaching people because i learn i started learning i want to learn english i started learning and i am not quitting that i am still learner i still read some books and uh, and i i famous books i am going to show to you this after end of the presentation and uh, uh, so that that's how the people uh, be very successful so my question is how many people are better or because you live okay so that's how i am living my life and thanks for your blessings thanks for your uh, attend uh, you know paying some attention to this uh, slides and uh, thanks for listening and if you have any questions feel free to ask now so i am done with my presentation slides but if you have any questions i am here uh, maybe few 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 question and answers please anybody want to ask any questions so no, good evening sir good evening sir yes sir from sangil pande we are not in second year excel engineering college sir i have one question sir go ahead 
what is tool used to your success in your life sir what is the book that you see here no sir do you see my uh, my video yes sir even yes, sapphire yeah do you know do you know this gentleman yes sir dr ab abdul kalam okay can you can you talk about 30 seconds about him talk about 30 seconds about him hey sir hey can sir okay sir go ahead speak about abdul kalam for 30 seconds dr ab abdul kalam Mm, go go fast! You have thirty seconds. It's complete test. Be analytical engineering, sir. Um, he's a scient scientist in the world. He his background from poor family, but he is success to dream to success in life. Okay, your thirty seconds is up. Very good. Good. Yes, sir. Sir. I, I am. I really appreciate you. Hey, you Thank have you, a guts, you have a guts to speak. That is what important. <clears throat> Very important. You have a good attitude. By the way, this is what you. <clears throat> you yes, have sir. a good attitude. Thank you, sir. Okay. See, yes, Abdul sir. Kalam. If you think Abdul Kalam, even when you are sleeping, when somebody wakes you up, when uh, somebody asks you, "Hey, what is your dream?" You should be crying. <laughs> hey, this is what my dream. You, you, yeah. Dream should not. Dream should not be. Uh, beg you to sleep. When you tell, when you tell you, somebody should laugh at you. That is what this man has done. He is a dreamer, and are you a good dreamer? Do you have a guts to guts to to dream big? That is so important. <coughs> so, if you ask me, what is my what is the success formula? Dream big. Don't worry. Dream big. Sir, I have a question. One of the participants suited at. What about the impact after the COVID nineteen in manufacturing industries? Yes. See, man. Uh, of course, we all need to respect. We all need to respect each other. Uh, I am working in manufacturing industry. We take all kinds of uh, precautions, measure uh, precautions, and we do that the social distancing. And the industry definitely. all the industry i you know everybody knows it is a news uh, it it will all industry will will go down and will come up it is a big recession so so if you are if you are able to run this that is why you need to have a stability stable mindset and a lot of lot of manufacturing companies might might go down but they will come up don't worry the situation will change that's why i am a believe see i have a choice to believe right i have a choice to believe my choice is It, this situation will be will be good will be good in a few months and uh, we should be able to do well sir one more question what is the tool used for t square test and then regression test yeah it is it is a formula it is a, a formula is very simple formula uh, you can you can apply uh, it is like a, yes a, you know a plus b whole square right it is like uh, expected value you go through that you are going to apply in excel sheet and uh, have uh, your uh, observed value and you can uh, see what is your expected value and then uh, you can apply into the formula and get the number the best the best thing is you are getting out of a p value there are so many test variants and you get the p value of that and based on that uh, you can take a decision इंपैक्ट ऑफ आर पी एन इन युअर प्रोजेक्ट यू मीन रिग्रेशन टेस्ट और वॉट इज आर थ्री आर पी एन Okay, uh, it's about it's a it's about the ten percent. That's what I was shown the, as a uh, as a ten percent variation. That's what we see as of now. But uh, we'll come to know uh, actual result like in uh, two three months in the twenty twenty one. That's why expected uh, 
uh, project. It is still going on live. So thank you, sir. Uh, the questions are out of questions. <laughs> yeah, and uh, no, sir, one more question, sir. Uh, go ahead. No, sir. Go ahead, sir. Sir, uh, my question is that as an entrepreneur, as an entrepreneur, how will you start your first startup, sir? Okay, very good question. I really love this question, by the way. Who's, what's your name? Vijay Kumar, sir, from Excel Engineering College. Okay. See, uh, okay, this is a secret formula for you. If you can understand and implement this, okay? What is the book that you are seeing there? The compound effect. Okay, do you know what is compound effect? Compound effect, I... I sorry, deeply I don't know, sir. Okay. See, everybody, every one of us, we all have eight hours and we are all eight hour productive. Correct? Yeah. Whereas all the entrepreneurs in the world take it as a Microsoft or KFC or Tata's or Billas or uh, Amazon or anybody, they have duplicated their time, not the money. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Yeah, it is like, for example, today you are a professor and you, we all thank uh, Dr. Uh, Karnagaran because he has duplicated. See, if I have to talk to one person, it is the same one hour. Today, I was able to speak with 100 people and uh, I, I hope you carry some good values. And 100 people, it is being my time, today, not one hour, 100 hours productivity for me. I am very yeah. happy today that I am able to share my not 100 hours. That means okay, it's okay, it's not about money, it's about how much time I leverage today. So, yeah. the same thing for any entrepreneur, if you want to become a best entrepreneur, you need to go through 80% struggle. Only 20% yeah. are entrepreneurs. And in that 20% mindset, you need to have a mindset of thinking combo, how to duplicate your time. That is so important. And rest all fall in place. Yeah. Does that answer you? Uh, sir, uh, suppose uh, for how to approach for funding purpose, sir, if you are starting your first startup, no. If you have no money for the starting that startup or build that startup, then, sir, what are the way to approach for funding, sir? Very good. Very good question again. See, my life is answer for that. Where there is a will, there is a way. Who said this? Vivekananda said this, where there is a will, there is a way. Arise, awake, don't stop till your goal is reached. If you are really, if your project is really useful for the society, there are so yeah. many people who are ready to fund you. But you need to understand the networking. You need to understand power of, power of social media, social commerce, and then yeah. leverage, leverage all this. There are so many people who are ready to fund, but you, there are so many universities in America. There are so many colleges. They have 200, 300 thousand dollars like that for a simple, simple projects. Spread the wing, spread the wing, go, you know, don't. That's why I said, Why they said that? Because don't restrict to Kenneth Tavalai. No, just go beyond, go beyond from your jar of thinking, jar thinking, go beyond. That's important. Don't worry, you will get a solution. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Yeah, the reason I'm saying I did not yeah. have my passport. I did not even had my passport in the age of 19, I know around 20 or 2000. But I had a dream. I wanted to visit 15 countries. I am I am in 15th country as of now speaking. I I went all around 15 countries. That is why I'm telling I'm not about bragging about me. I'm giving you, a, I'm instilling that dream in you that if you dream big, your passport will come, your visa will come. Uh, whoever comes, uh, don't worry. You will achieve whatever you want. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much. I think, uh, uh, Deepak, we can close the call, right? Yes, sir. We can close it, sir. Anyway, Karnagaran, sir. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you, Selvaraj Nagamuthu, sir, for your wonderful presentation. You presented uh, about a research uh, project. 
and also uh, the second uh, slide about uh, you and your family uh, okay uh, i know about you uh, you are uh, uh, i know about you you developed a lot uh, from the basic uh, um, your motivational speech also uh, will be very much useful to our students uh, faculty members uh, okay with this uh, i i thank selva selva selvaraj sir once again and also all the participant uh, attended this webinar and this is the fourth fourth day of the webinar uh, tomorrow uh, at 6 uh, to 7 tomorrow at 6 uh, pm uh, we have the last fifth day seminar I love you ready for that okay thank you thank you orundal uh, thank you thank you sir thank you selva sir engineering i thank yeah. orundal yeah thank you thank you so much for the opportunity thank you uh, thank, thank you, you selva sir you. and then uh, thank you selva sir it is a wonderful presentation uh, the presentation was simple but your thoughts is a valuable one i, I hope every participant understand that and then uh, values are so important you explained very clearly with your own experience that was a good experience sir thank you for your wonderful presentation sir sir any time any time i am for india east or west india is best i am from india i am from tamil nadu i wanted to make use of my time thank you so much again namaste vanakkam thank you sir